One of the biggest challenge which I have faced as a woman in AI or in any industry, right, or in any area is imposter syndrome. I think it's a very common with women at at least 80% of women has this particular problem because we always think that, okay, we are not perfect. Even though we give 100%, we always feel that, okay, I have given only 50% to this particular um, area, whether it's my professional area or it's my personal area. We are always have are in a low confidence. And especially in this tech world, right, in a rapidly evolving field, where every day a new technology is coming, a new paper is coming. It's very easy to feel that, okay, I won't be able to cope up with this new technologies. And that is the same feeling was amplified for me also while balancing the family and the parental responsibilities. And that time I also used to question myself, oh, will I be able to keep up with the pace? And but what I have learned is that imposter syndrome thrives on comparison. The turning point came when I stopped measuring myself against everything I didn't know. And I instead focus on what I know and what value I can bring it on the table. So whether it was a simplifying the complex problems or the designing the solutions in the real world or enabling my team to innovate. So my advice for anyone facing this is twofold. Please find your community because having peers with the say who are struggling with the same problems or then you will realize that, okay, you are not alone and having a good mentor who can always guide you, motivate you, constantly tell us that, okay, Mega, you have this strength, you have this skill, you, you just need to move out of your comfortable zone or you have to just break the boundary. And second is, own your strength. Be confident. We all are here for a reason. We have lots of ideas. We have lots of innovations. And even if you see across the world that the ladies or the women, they bring a lot of great ideas. We need to just bring it. So please remember, it's never late to start and grow in AI or in any space. Even I am in this industry since last 14 years. But as a speaker, I have started this my speaker journey since just last year. If we start step by step, we can actually come up where this world is growing into the AI world.